This is James Elder for IFL TV in association with Macklin's Gym Marbella. I'm in Manchester, they were hired actually at the Hatton Gym. With me, I've got undefeated Sergei Revchenko. What's happening, Sergei? You alright? Yes, I'm fine. Thank good, you. Good. How, yep. How's life been treating you? <laughs> How has everything been with you? Uh, slowly, please. <laughs> How has everything been with you? Everything okay. Yeah, always okay. That's good. <laughs> That's what I like to hear. I'm here to talk to you about your fight in Australia coming up against Anthony Mund yes. Mundine. I hope I pronounced that right. Yes. Talk to me a little bit about that fight. What, yes, what I, do you know about Mundine? Yes, I, uh, yes, I feel very well. Uh, uh, I have uh, started training camp in June uh, in France. Uh, I um, uh, training for physically in montagne, uh, uh, swimming, uh, sea. Yes, but uh, now I a little rest and after I continue my training camp in England uh, with Hatton and Frank Jackson. Yeah, indeed, indeed. How important is it to you that you keep getting these fights and Ricky Hatton spending time on Hatton Promotions taking you about to, to, to where the big fights are? Yeah, yeah, very, very, very happy, very, very, very big thank you for Ricky, for organization, uh, my training camp, uh, for organization uh, fight. Uh, yes, I'm sure uh, we win with Ricky. Mm. Yes. Having a look at the box rec now about the fight, it seems billed as quite quite a good a good card against Mundine in Australia. Are you excited to go out there? Uh, slowly, please. Are you excited to go out to Australia to fight? No, no, no. That's not you. Big show. Oh yeah, yeah, big show because uh, uh, Anthony Mundine in in England, very very great fighter, very big, very, very popular, very top man, and I'm sure what I win. How are you finding life in Manchester? How how do you like England? Yes, I like, I like, because very friendly people, very nice training camp, always with me, very smiley, very interesting, really, Manchester City, <laughs> uh, England champion. <laughs> You've got the great benefit of having a uh, former world champion, Ricky Hatton, in the gym with you, um, as well as Mike Jackson doing some of your training. How important is that for you, that, that Ricky spends a bit of time with you and stuff? Uh, I, th I think uh, I think what Ricky Hatton uh, 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 give me very big help uh, for world champion for world title. Mm -hmm. Very big experience. Indeed. If you get the job done in Australia, are we are then anticipating you fighting again on the UK soil, fighting again in England? I don't know. Maybe. Maybe. I, I want. I want. After after fight in England. I like England. Yeah. <laughs> Could you tell me about some of the sparring you've had so far for your training camp? Who have you had in for sparring? For sparring? Hmm? No, it's I, I don't know. Yes, no, not on sparring because I have, I have more time for uh, rest, for start a good big diet uh, and uh, I don't know. I think uh, now not sparring, only for boxing, tactically, yes, special only boxing now. Uh, sparring later because I have uh, one month two week in England and after I go fly in Australia one month for adaptation for continue and finish training camp. All right, well listen, I wish you the best of luck in Melbourne. As I said, um, good luck with your training camp. I hope everything thank goes as it should be. And thank you for giving IFL TV a little bit of your time today, Sergei. I really appreciate it. Thank you.